Good afternoon. New Mexico is short hundreds of doctors. Just ask anyone who has tried to make an appointment with a new physician. Many doctors point to extremely high insurance premiums in the state as a reason that it is tough doing business here. But now the state is stepping in to help. A grant program could mean tens of thousands in state money to give physicians and midwives relief from those premiums. News 13's Natalie Wattis spoke with the DOH to find out more. We absolutely could use more providers in our birthing workforce. We need a robust multidisciplinary workforce. We need midwives and physicians who are interested in working together to make sure that we meet the needs of New Mexicans in all of our communities. Abigail Reese, Maternal Health Program Manager with the New Mexico Department of Health, says the cost of malpractice insurance can be a significant expense for this workforce. And, and the costs continue to rise as people remain in practice, even if they have no claims, even if they have no bad outcomes, just the longevity in practice, you know, leads to an increasing premium. In 2008, the state legislature took steps to try to help offset these costs with the Birthing Workforce Retention Fund grants. The Birthing Workforce Retention Fund is specifically about making sure that we're um, doing something to address the fact that also um, those liability costs are high for this particular specialty. Qualified applicants could get up to $10,000 in grant money. Reese says this aims to support and retain these physicians and midwives in the state, but also to hopefully attract more. That workforce is very precious and limited for us, and we want to be able to support um, an adequate birthing workforce in our state. Natalie Wattis, KRQE News 13. The Department of Health is still accepting applications for these grants until April 22nd. For more information, just head over to alwayson.krqe.com.